They were landmark wins, weren't they? There was plenty in. There was emotion in those games, and we've seen emotion early. Look at this. That is a huge amount of Bulldogs that have gone to two Swans. They've gone to Hanbury, gone to Kennedy. And the response was swift this time for the Bulldogs. Kennedy. Papley is some space in the forward line. You can't give him that. Put himself in the line of fire. Reaps the rewards. Now Dalhouse as a result. With five metres in the clear. And Dunkley in really tight. Redpath was the longer target. Decided to go halfway in between with Dixon. He's run a long way. But he's kicked a brilliant goal. <laughs> the Bond is one-on-one -on -one with Rampy. Ling John's powering back to the goals. He puts his faith, though, instead in McRae to fly from the side. And down there is Bailey Dale off the left boot. And he lights it up. They're coming from everywhere for the Dogs. Sky ball inside the 50. Dunkley versus Lloyd. Lloyd did what he had to do. He's trying to get some sort of explosion and get him up into the 50. Oh. Dixon again. What a start for Tory Dixon and the Dogs. He's weighted the kick. Bonapelli was the leader. He gets there with the spoil. The ball wins it magnificently. It deserves a goal. The talent and the brilliance of Marcus Bontempelli. Plays restarted again. And Norton, oh, look at that. Luke Parker nails him down. And it's holding the ball. This is suddenly a crucial kick for the Swans who find themselves 22 points down. The Bulldogs fans giving it to him. He's impervious to the distractions. And look what it means to the Swans. Parker has three goals already. Short for Buddy. He's still looking for his first. This could be it, though. We know that Lance can launch. And he doesn't this time. He saw Heaney. And that was a terrific decision. Yeah, he's slowed a little today. This is his 10th disposal. We are seeing him mature. You know, the fine player we all expected. That could be a very important goal on halftime. Hanabry tried to get it through to Haywood. Who hasn't much impact so far. Kennedy just with brute force. Cunningham gets it onto the boot. Fantastic reflex goal. In the opening two or three minutes of quarter three. And the dogs will be feeling the heat right now. English to Bontem Pally. The Bont with the handball. Hunter restricted. In fact, Hunter well below his normal output, just six disposals. He's been their leading position winner this year. He's been a, played a really important role in the wing. Papley down. This year. So what happened to Papley? Yeah, what was that? Hunter? Hunter? Hunter. 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 Decides not to go to Hunter. Oh. I think he did in the end. It comes a cropper. Towers. And here's Franklin. Finds Sinclair. The second mistake the house has made, just going back in board. Richards will fly here, but Buddy, he's got it. He loves this place too. And he loves kicking them like that, and he knew straight away who was through the middle. That's his second. And that's the way it's going at the moment. McVeigh spots Heaney, just can't quite connect. It stays in, and that may not work for Richards, who's gone. One last look into the 50. And keeps it low. It's not going to be easy to mark, but Wallace did well. He got a little buffering. Early in the second, really. Here's the shot. Mitch Wallace. Dogs fans know that he has to kick straight. And he has delivered! Just like that! From Tory Dixon. So, a long time between drinks. But now that it's come, and maybe they can snatch a bit back. Suckling. Penetration on the kick. There's one swan down. There's two swan down. The last man standing was Marcus Bontempelli. <laughs> Two in a row. That's an extraordinary piece of play. Crafty kick. And went in between the dogs' targets. Hanabry and Kennedy. That midfield combination outstanding. And Franklin got rid of Easton Wood. Yeah, Wood fell over. So he loves playing under the roof at Eddie Hat Stadium. <laughs> He's been able to slot that. First blood to the Swans. 
And now the focus is on the wing. Grundy cleared it for Mills. Back into the middle, Nick Bay. Takes the time to strategize just for a moment or two. No shortage of targets and hands in the air. He puts his faith in Towers, who takes the mark. That'd be a great time for a straight kick. And Dean Towers, he knows that and he delivers in style. Doggies are trying and they're just not being able to capitalise. Maybe this time, Caleb Daniel, it's a searing ball. He couldn't hang on to the mark, Dunkley. Still very much alive. Wallace, the setup complete. It just needs somebody to stand tall. And guess who has the smallest man there? Caleb Daniel. The ball in safe hands for the moment. Parker. We've got to find a man now, the dogs. Oh, oh it's a bad hit. Caleb Daniel. Got a little present there. Gets a little bit fancy, a little too fancy. The umpire said he got a handball away. Richards to Dunkley again. Dahlhaus, this time, he's got it. It's still alive. Jeez. 45 seconds. The kick, Franklin comes late. He crashed the pack. Kennedy, Heaney, was he out? He was close to it. This has got through. Florent. He has a look behind. He's got English in the rearview mirror. There's been some big moments in the last quarter. This is the one that counts. And Ollie Florent makes it his. Wow, what a goal. What a great goal for you.